Hi everyone, good day. I am Kate Orman Tabalu Morba from College of Health and Sciences Education Department under the program of Bachelor of Science in Pharmacy. And for today's video, let us talk about the fundamental concepts of the sport by Ben Tom. Badminton is a court game that can be played either singles or doubles by men, women, and even mix of pairs, either indoors or outdoor courts as fun or highly competitive level. The history and origin of badminton was originated from the ancient civilization of Europe and Asia known as bottle door or bot and puddle and shuttlecock more than 2,000 years ago. In 1600s, the sport was an upper class pastime in England and many European countries. A contemporary form of badminton called Poon was played in India in 1800s where the net was also introduced. In the Philippines in 1920s, the game was established by British and American refugees. Hence, throughout the years, the sport became developed which made an impact to countries across the globe. For the facilities and equipments to be used in playing badminton, there are four. These are rocket, shuttle cup, badminton court, and post. And now for the grip. The grip is very important in the game of badminton, not just for competitiveness but also for injury prevention purposes. So here are the following grips in the game of badminton. For the forehand grip technique, slide the rocket down until you reach the grip with your right hand on your rocket's face. Close it with your first three fingers, place your thumb over the middle finger, and your hand should now create a V position with the rocket grip. For a second grip technique, start with the forehand grip and move to the backhand grip by placing the pointing finger on the flat end of your rocket and the thumb on the flat end. For our last technique, for an overhead backhand grip technique, place your thumb in a groove that is unencored to your grip right here. This will serve two purposes. It allows you to swing with full power without putting any restrictions on your wrist. And now, let's talk about the badminton footsteps. First is we have the launch. It is frequently used in badminton. Make sure that the heel touches the floor first and place the racket foot on the ground and move to the For our second footstep, we have the scissor jump. This type of step formation can be used to deliver a powerful shot from the back of the court. Next, the badminton split step or also known as the split drop. It is a technique of modeling your stance to get ready for the next shot from the opponent. Next, we have the side shuffle. Arms bent and knees soft with a neutral spine. Step forwards with your right foot and then diagonally backwards and sideways with your left. In doing this, you will shuffle forwards and backwards and out to your left. For our last footstep, we have the China Jump. The key thing about this footstep is that you would about take off and land on the same single foot. discussing the fundamental concepts or some information with regards to the sport badminton. For now, it's time for us to apply those steps, those techniques in actual game, together with my friend from College of Engineering, hence Dave Lauren. Without further ado, let's jump right into the video!